Hello YouTubers, it's me again and welcome to my video and I have another unbagging. So I ordered again from cowcow.com and I got myself another pair of shoes and they just arrived today and oh, I'm tired because it's hot outside and I've been walking all over the place. Oh, alright. So this is about my one, two, three, fourth pair of shoes. And let's get them open. Which is a better way to open it? I guess this side. Okay. Just set that over there. So, here are the shoes. These ones will be a little bit diff- these are a different style. Because I got the- the high- the high- the, I forgot what they're called. Okay. Okay. Alright. So these are the, like the sport shoes. These are the sport shoes. And these ones are like the flat, like skateboarding shoes, something like that. But these ones are sport heavy-duty shoes. Alright, here they are. So, this is what it looks like. Quite, quite interesting. <laughs> quite interesting. Okay, just taking this, the paper out. If the shoe will work with me for a little bit. Just gonna try my best to take out the, the little pieces of paper. Alright, so this is the left shoe. I can't believe it took me a while. Oh, I'm so tired. And here is the other shoe. So these are, this is, this is a Dragon Age character, and this is Alistair. And there was supposed to be another Dragon Age character right here who was supposed to be Cullen from the Inquisition, but he was in all three games. But he's no longer there, so it has to be this long um, Templar, Templar sword in the middle. I'm a little bit disappointed that um, um, Cullen wasn't, couldn't be put there, but yeah, I have my reasons, and I'll get to it in a little bit after I take this stuff out. Take that out. So, yeah. Okay, so these are the sports shoes, the, like, the heavy-duty sports shoes or whatever, and it has the little bumps at the bottom. Bumps at the bottom. And these ones right here, they don't have the bumps. It's flat foot or whatever, flat foot. <laughs> but, yes, there it is. So, I decided to... I order from Cow Cow because they have um, all of these designs and stuff and I love Dragon Age and got myself Dragon Age shoes because just plain shoes are boring. I like my stuff to have like style and stuff like that, so yes. And the reason why I got the um, sports shoes is because... Um, these are breaking, like you could see right there. There's already a hole in both, in already in both of them. And I've only had these shoes, I've only had these shoes for a month, and they've already have holes in them. It's starting to form down there. It's like, it's crazy. I mean, I've only had these shoes for a month. And it's crazy. And, um, these are my first pair that I got three years ago. And these are the pair that I brought with me to Japan. And I stayed in Japan for two weeks. And every day we woke up like at seven or eight o'clock in the morning. And then we didn't come back until like 10 or 11 o'clock sometimes. And we walked everywhere. And there are no holes in these. These were the ones I brought with me to 
um, these are the ones I bought with me to Japan and there was no holes, no holes. And I went to um, close to Mount Fuji, I went into the forest, onto the rocky paths, I went to the um, suicide forest, to the... I even went inside the caves where it's all pointy and rocky and these still survived. And I've had these for about three, for about three years and I've had these for about three years, but after a year I did order another pair, which is strange. This is the second pair that I got after a year passed on that one. And these started to form holes as well, but these didn't start to form until like... Like, um... Maybe six months, seven months, something like that. And... I... Don't really go anywhere. I don't go out into the forest like I did in Japan. I... Pretty much just go from my house to the post office, which is 12 minutes, like, it's about 12 minute trip. That's pretty much where I go every day. And it's all, it's a flat surface all the way there. So I don't, I don't know why these broke so quickly. But as for these ones, which is only a month old, <laughs> holy smokes, a month old. And I pretty, and because of COVID, because of COVID, I barely, barely go red anymore. And these already have a hole in them. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. So this time I decided to go with this one. I decided to go with the sports shoes to see if it's a little bit better, a little bit better, a little bit stronger, and it's um interesting, but yes. These were about $50 Canadian, and it took about a month to get to me. About, it took about a month to get to me. So, yeah. And I also got myself backups, just in case. Just in case these ones break. But I also got these for another purpose, is because it's October, it's becoming winter soon, because, you know, I live in Canada, it becomes winter very quickly. So I got myself some more winter boots because, um, my old winter boots that I've had for seven years have been completely falling apart like pieces at the bottom or chunks falling out. So I got these pairs of, sh pairs of boots and these were very, very pricey, but I had to get them. I had no choice in order for me to survive through that winter walking and stuff like that. So, so yeah, and I'll probably try and put this on. I'll try, try. I'll try, try. All right. To be honest, they kind of look like old people's shoes. <laughs> it has been a very long time since I wore. I always had um. I've always had these high, high shoes. These whatever they're called. This is like so so low. <laughs> These look like my grandma's shoes. That's what I call them is grandma shoes. Or grandpa shoes or something like that. But they do fit. They do fit. And I did get a compliment on these shoes today when I was out. They said, oh, I love your shoes. I went, thank you. I'm getting a new pair today. <laughs> but yeah. So I will probably do a review on these ones. And yeah. So hopefully you like my video and... Peace. And I did order something else from Cow Cow, which is probably going to come maybe in like a week or two or something and make another video on that. So hopefully you like this video and peace. Ow! I have to be careful. Peace. And yes, I do have nail polish on. It is Hollow Taco from Nail Logical. And yeah. <laughs>